Hi all, welcome to the best of CAT series by IMS and I am Parmeshwar over here. Today we will look at a question on geometry and the question goes like this. So before you see the solution, kindly give it a try and then look at the solution over here. The question goes like this. A solid metallic cube is melted to form a solid 5 cubes having a volume in the ratio of 1 is to 1 is to 8 is to 27 is to 27. Then they have told you the percentage by which the sum of the surface area of those six, uh, those five cube will exceed the surface area of the original cube is nearest to. Now in this particular question again, since you observe the objective is to find out the percentage increase. What we can do is without taking any variable into account, if I assume the volume, let's say for the five pieces to be a 1, 1, 8, 27, 27, then we know that the volume of a cube the volume happens to be nothing but cube of the side. So if I look at the five pieces and if the volume are taken to be as 1, 1, 8, 27 and 27, then what do you think about the volume of the original cube? Since we know that if you melt a certain item, then the volume before and after must be equal. So if you add the numbers 1, 1, 8, 27, 27, 1 gets a 64. Now we know that if the volume happens to be a 1, 1, 8, 27, 27, 64, then what can I say about the ratio of the sides or what about the side? So 1, 1, 2, 3, 3 and 4 over here. So we got the sides of the five pieces. We also got the side of the bigger cube also, which happens to be four in this particular case. Now, what about the surface area? The surface area of the a cube will depend on the square of the ratio of their sides. So in this particular case, one can say, what about the term side square will be? A one, one, four, nine and nine. So what does it mean? If I ask you how much is the volume or the surface area of the five pieces put together, it will be nothing but 6 times of side square. 6 will not going to play a role as such because 6 is going to get cancelled out. So one can say the total surface area of the 5 cubes will come out to be nothing but as you can take 6 times of side square. So 6 into 1 plus 6 into 1 plus 6 into 4 plus 6 into 9 plus 6 into 9. So one can take 6 common and one can simply say 1 plus 1 plus 4 plus 9 plus 9. What about the total surface area of the original cube? This thing must be equal to nothing but 6 times of side square. So 6 into 4 square become nothing but 16. So now if one compare, we get this particular part as 6 times of 24 as 144 and this particular part basically becomes equal to 96. So if I say that the surface area of the original cube happened to be 96 square, let's say centimeter for example, then the total surface area of all the five cubes put together become nothing but a 144 square centimeter. So if I ask you how much is the increase, so one can say it's an increase of a 48 over 96, this part simplified down to a 1 by 2 or one can say a 50 percent. So my required answer for this particular question must be an option number 2 here. Now if you have understood this particular concept well, kindly give it a try in the next, uh, in the replica question and put your answer in the comment section.